In this video, we're going to be talking about the Lifter LMS lab called Action Manager. And essentially what the Action Manager allows you to do is to decide certain features that display on your course page or your lesson page or not. And the reason this is in a lab is because these settings do make database calls and uh, we want to keep the main Lifter LMS plugin lightweight. But if you want to be able to remove certain things like you see on the screen, like the course uh, author, who is Thomas in this case, or the, the, uh, the metadata, the course information, the estimated time, the categories, and all those things, without having to write code, you can now do that with the Lifter LMS lab called Action Manager. So Thomas, take us on a tour and show us what this is all about. Sure. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you can grab the Lifter LMS Lab plugin. It's free on WordPress.org. Once that's installed, you'll, you'll have this new meta, menu item, Lifter LMS Labs. Um, you come over here. This is the Action Manager. We've got some documentation and things that you can take a look at on your own time if you'd like. But all you need to do is click Enable. It's going to redirect you to the Action Manager settings screen. So you'll see there's, uh, I think there's about 30, 35 options right here. Uh, and all these, all these checkboxes correspond to a specific piece of information. Uh, on, on your, your courses, your lessons, your uh, membership and course catalogs. Uh, we'll probably be adding more things in the future. So if there's any other default elements in Lifter LMS that you feel you should be able to easily remove with a checkbox, of course, just let us know. Uh, but let's just start with a quick demonstration. Like Chris said, um, the author information, if you're looking at author information, um, your, your teacher's uh, or administrator's uh, name, their avatar, and a short biography, you can very easily remove that by coming down to course actions, um, finding the author, it's meta information author, and then save. So you just check that box, and when you reload your course, you'll see that goes away. Um, so again, there's a lot of different pieces of information, different elements that Lifter LMS adds. Um, for example, you might not want to put the outline, the course syllabus here, because as you can see in our little demo here, we have the outline um, in the sidebar. So maybe we want to remove that too. So then we could go to the syllabus under courses, save that, and that'll now go away. Um, so there, there's a lot of different options. Uh, you, can, you can experiment with these. Um, and uh, that will allow you to hopefully customize the interface of your courses, your lessons, and your course and membership catalogs to your satisfaction. Thanks.